Thank you for watching US Classic Muscle Cars. Please enjoy this next video. Like us, share, subscribe to us on Facebook and social media. Uh, my name is Pete Sanchez. I'm the owner of Custom Cars Unlimited in LaGrange, Illinois. And uh, we're show showcasing this here 1967 Lincoln four-door convertible at the uh, Oak Brook Father's Day show this year. And I just would like to spend a couple minutes to go over the car. Uh, this is a, about a three-year project. Originally, when the car came to us, it was uh, white, uh, kind of tired. And we actually never started out to do this. It just kind of evolved into the car that we see today. Uh, when we had originally taken the car apart and stripped it down to bare metal, there was quite a bit of rust in the four corners. So we took the car completely apart and then we had it chemically stripped. We were able to uh, purchase the used parts out of a boneyard in Texas and brought them back to uh, Chicago. Had those parts sent out and uh, chemically stripped. And then we took those parts and uh, put them on the car and uh, made a really nice, solid, rust-free body. And then from there, we uh, did the body work. As you can see, it's got a beautiful paint job on it. And uh, we upgraded the, uh, the uh, brakes with their four-wheel disc brakes. Uh, it's got a nine-inch Ford rear end with Posi. Um, these are uh, billet tires. I'm sorry, billet wheels. Uh, I looked through their catalog and I ran across these particular rims and I thought they were like perfect for the car. And of course I had to go with the white walls and the Vogues. Uh, the interior is all brand new leather. We've upgraded the all the gauges, the stereo system, the uh, steering wheel. It has vintage air, heating and air conditioning, Alpine stereo system, uh, camera, reverse camera in the rear view mirror. Um, and we've gone through all the mechanisms. There's like uh, 42 switches for the top and about 24 motors, I believe. It has a, uh, let me show you the engine compartment. The owner wanted to have a little get up and go because he says that this thing never really ran fast. Especially when he wanted to go on the highway, just kind of keeping up with traffic. So we purchased a uh, an early 70 460 Lincoln motor and put aluminum heads on it. It's got fuel injection and it has the billet serpentine system. We put a modern uh, cooling system, kind of like a modern car so this thing can idle all day long even if it's over 100 degrees outside. And it has basically everything you need on it to really make this a, an extremely nice cruiser. Uh, how much horsepower this has? This has about uh, 500, 550 horsepower. The uh, entire underneath of the car looks just like the top. It has all stainless steel hardware on it, stainless steel exhaust, four mufflers. We've had all the chrome sent out to be redone. Uh, no, it's, uh, it's got to be hundreds and hundreds of hours. It's a total of a, a three-year project. It took uh, it took probably about six months just to do the body work on it, and then it took quite a while, weeks and weeks and weeks, to get the body this straight and getting all the gaps just right. And the trunk and the convertible top mechanism work from a little switch in the fuel door over here. Originally, this car would have had a key cylinder on the quarter panel, which would have been original. 
but uh, we replaced that and just put the spring on the inside. Now the top opens and you can see all the mechanisms in here. Everything has been restored, all the wiring, every switch, all the pumps. It has uh, four pumps, or four cylinders, one huge pump. All the hardware is all correct, all the rubber, everything for the car. Um, yeah, we spent, we spent a lot of time on it. And the uh, mechanism works just absolutely perfect. But it took a lot of time to get it to do what it's doing. Just hours and hours and hours of troubleshooting. Everything has to work in a certain sequence. It's really a nice job, nice cruiser. I wouldn't mind owning this one myself. How's the car to drive? I was just going to say that. Uh, I've driven it a couple of times. It's really great. Very quick. Very quick. I would imagine. And um, it's just a, a, a fun car to drive. Huh. Sounds great. Looks beautiful. Who had all the ideas? Look at that. That's what a sleep. Who had all the ideas? Uh, a lot of the ideas were mine. And, uh, you know, the younger kids that work in my shop were uh, originally kind of uh, snickering and think, thought that they were uh, old man's ideas, but uh, I think this is spot on just the way it is. And um, it's a big hit at all the shows. The owner was here today and he's excited and we should give it to him in about two more weeks. We have about 250 miles on the car right now and we'd like to give him with about 500 miles of total uh, operation. And then we have the, uh, those uh, suicide doors there. Yeah, the suicide doors are, uh, that's original, of course, which is great for getting in and out. And uh, we've done everything on the inside of the car, every square inch, every nut and bolt. And you know what, it has such a different look when the, uh, the top is down. Yes, you know? yes. You know, wow, wow. Yeah, yeah, wow. this is, uh, this is, this is a real beauty. And the uh, paint job on this here is the Glaseret, Glaseret paint system, and it's a base coat, clear coat system. Um, we, after painting it very clear, carefully, uh, this car was painted in components, and then we uh, hand sanded it and polished it. Uh, we've done quite a few cars like this over the years. I've been doing it personally for 48 years. And we have a nice staff, and uh, we're at uh, 340 East, Burlington Avenue in LaGrange and our number is 708-579-9918 uh, and uh, please give us a call we can handle just about anything if you have a dream that needs to be fulfilled we could make it happen and I thank you <laughs>